Outer Space is an emulation of a famous vintage tape echo that includes faithfully modeled delay and reverb functions. If you already own Outer Verb, this will be a free update. So let's get right into it. Outer Space allows you to create different combinations of echo and reverb that can be adjusted with a mode selector. The modes range from echo from just one tape head to just reverb alone. The settings are reproduced from the original effect, with the echo modes on the left side, combined echo and reverb modes towards the right, and reverb only down below at 6 o'clock. Moving on to the echo settings, Outer Space has three independently adjustable playback heads. You can adjust their rate by clicking and dragging under the tape head labels. You can sync to your host tempo or set a delay in milliseconds. Repeat rate changes the delay rate of the tape heads globally. Intensity is the delay feedback. We have a wow and flutter knob that introduces pitch inconsistencies due to factors like tape age and capstan rotation. It also introduces ducking effects, which can change according to the tape selector below. Above the echo settings, there is a basic EQ. Just like in the original, the EQ knobs by default only affect the echo section. If you'd like to enable them on the reverb as well, you can do that from the More menu above. Over on the bottom left, there are some additional echo settings. Send, also known as the dub switch, disables the signal sent to the echo section. This is really useful for creating echo effects with feedback. I like to put outer space on a bus and automate the send to cut once the feedback or intensity starts to self-oscillate. That way it's easy to play with the feedback signal while keeping the original instrument going. Wet only cuts the dry signal. Stereo is useful if you want to add depth to a mono source. You can fake a stereo signal with this switch, effectively making the source dual mono by delaying the right channel by about 15 milliseconds. Noise is a mixture of tape and unit noise. An envelope makes the noise a static background element or tells the unit to follow the transients of the input. Outer Space is available now at audiothing.net.